Hi, I'm Lene. Welcome to my channel, Fashionably 50 Something and Beyond. I aim to provide content to women over 50 that includes fashion, hauls, crafts, and maybe someday a little bit of cooking. This is my second video, so if you're new here, so am I. For my second video, I had my outfits planned, I had everything set to go, but then one day I was in Walmart and I stumbled upon these cute wide leg jeans. These jeans are cropped and for reference I am 5'7". I just had to buy these jeans and then I decided to devote my whole second video to these jeans and styling them. These jeans are by the brand Energy. They are made up of a blend of cotton, polyester, and elastane. They have a lot of stretch and a lot of give. These were in the juniors department so I did size up. They have about a one inch hem at the bottom and they are a high rise with a zipper closure. They feature four patch pockets, two in the front and two in the back. For this first look, I paired these jeans with this graphic tee that I ordered from Walmart.com. This graphic tee is by Crazy Dog Tees and was designed and printed in the USA. That's one of the things I liked about it. This t-shirt is made of 100% cotton and it does say to wash in cold water inside out. This t-shirt runs small, so when ordering, you would want to order a size up. I ordered up to an extra large because I like my tees a little bit roomy. Um, I can see myself wearing this outfit to a summer picnic or out shopping at a farmer's market. I like the B on the front. Um, I like the message, be happy. I think a graphic tee adds a pop of fun to any wardrobe. This t-shirt was $16.99 on the Walmart website. Now I'll run down the cost of this outfit. These jeans were $15. This t-shirt was $17. So together, that brings this cost of this outfit to $32. I paired this outfit with my Time and True Gladiator sandals that I got from Walmart.com. These are $12.98. And I also have a moto jacket that I am going to put on because say you're out in the evening and it starts to get a little chilly, You'd want to have a jacket on hand. So I believe this moto jacket kind of finishes off the look. This moto jacket is just one that I had in my closet. And I feel it makes a nice addition to this outfit. Now let's move on to the next look. For this next look, I've paired these jeans with this tiered top from Walmart. This top is by the brand No Boundaries and it is a Junior's. So I sized up to an extra large. This top has two tiers of ruffles and four working buttons at the V-neck. It also features a tie in the back for a more fitted look. This top is made of 80% rayon and 20% polyester. It costs $9.96. I think this outfit as a feminine boho look to any wardrobe and I could see myself wearing this to an art fair or to an outdoor festival in the summer. Also I'm wearing the Time and True Gladiator sandals. These are also available at Walmart and they run $12.98. Now we're going to look at the total cost of this outfit. The jeans being $15 and the top being 10, brings this outfit to a cost of $25. I'm not going to include the shoes because I had those already. There, now we'll move on to our next look. Here I have paired these jeans with this twist top top from Walmart. This is by the brand Time and True. It has a short sleeve, a uh, dolman style sleeve, with a seam running down the front. This is in the color Dusty Rose. It also does come in black, gray, and green. It costs $11.98. It is still available in store and on the website. It's made of a blend of Lycosil, polyester, and spandex. 
And with this top, I have paired it with these faux suede slides in pink. These slides have a little bow at the top and a cushiony footbed. I got these shoes for $35 from Nordstrom Rack, but they are also available at Kohl's and at DSW. Now we're going to run down the total cost of this outfit with the jeans being 15 and the top being 12 and the shoes at 35. This whole outfit with shoes costs $62. I can see myself wearing this outfit in the summer um, just to run to the grocery store or go out to lunch with friends. I think it makes a cute summer outfit. Another nice look to pair with these crop jeans. Now we'll move on to our next look. Hello, I'm back. And this time I have paired these jeans with this smock tee that I bought from J. Crew last year. Uh, I like how the flowiness of the smock tee goes with the wide leg pant. Um, I did look up smock tees online and they are available at Old Navy, Kohl's, and Express. I bought this one on sale last year for $8.50. And with this, this outfit, I have paired them with these. These are from Target. They are calling these the Lorelei Cross Band Bow Sandal in yellow. And they are $14.99. They are still available on the Target website. They have this little bow in the front. And they do have a cushiony footbed. They are flat, but I will tell you that they are comfortable. And these, these shoes are $14.99. I can see myself having lunch at an outdoor cafe in this outfit, or shopping at an outdoor flea market, something like that. Now we'll run down the cost of this outfit. For the jeans being $15, and the top being $8.50, and the shoes being $15, this total cost of this outfit is $38.50 which I think is an awesome deal. Okay, so we've tried these jeans with a graphic tee, with a tiered top, with a twist tie top, and a smock top. And now we're wearing them with a peplum top. And I bought this peplum top at Kohl's last summer on clearance for $5. I did not get a chance to wear it last summer. I think it looks cute with these jeans. The shorter cut and the ruffle pair nicely with the high rise of these jeans. This top is by Lauren Conrad. It is 60% cotton and 40% polyester. And I think the color matches nicely with the stitching on these jeans. It matches nicely. But say I'm out in the evening and I'm getting a little bit chilly, I can also pair this outfit with a moto jacket. And then this moto jacket I bought a few years ago from Sam's Club. Sometimes you can find really nice clothes at Sam's Club. And I think this pairs nicely. It um, matches the top almost exactly. These shoes are by Brindley Company. These are also available on the Walmart website. They were $37. And I did buy them this season. They have about a one inch sole and a two inch heel. Now we'll run down the total cost of this outfit. With these jeans coming in at $15, and this top on clearance for five, and the shoes for $37, that brings the total cost of this outfit to $57. I won't include the moto jacket because I've had this for many years in my closet. Now I can see myself out going out to the movies with friends in this outfit, or going out to dinner. Now we'll move on to our next outfit. Okay, now I'm really comfortable in these jeans. Wearing them with this tie-dyed sweatshirt that I bought from Walmart. This sweatshirt is by Time and True, and it is in the color blue. It's 100% cotton and has a really nice uh, texture, a very nice feel to it. It's a nice weight. This sweatshirt is still available at Walmart. It, is, it comes in the colors pink, green, khaki, and violet. And they still have the multiple colors and sizes on their website. And another good note, this is um, on clearance right now for $7. With this 
outfit, I have paired it with these Time & True sneakers. These are $9.98 from Walmart. They come in a variety of uh, styles and colors. And I bought these earlier in the spring. But we'll run down the total cost of this outfit with the jeans being at 15, the top being at seven, and the shoes being at 10. Bring this outfit to $32. And I can see myself wearing this outfit on a Sunday afternoon with my family or out for a walk on a cool spring night. Well, there you have it. A pair of $15 jeans styled six different ways. I think these jeans uh, would be a very versatile piece in your wardrobe. And for $14.98, it's a real bargain. Thank you for joining me. I hope that these outfits help you to decide if wide leg jeans are for you. I know they're for me. I really like them. They're very comfortable and I just think they look so cute. Um, and until next time, have a great day. Bye.